Hi, how is everyone? My video today is going to be on why love is important in our lives. And I chose this topic because I'm a huge supporter of promoting love and kindness and what it does in our world when we have it. I don't believe that we are a society nowadays that really does show very much love. People seem to be afraid of it. It's People have been de deceived and hurt so many times that they just seem to run from it. And I want people to realize that love is not a bad thing. Love is actually a good thing. We do choose at times uh, the wrong people to, to give our love to, but that is a lesson that the universe is wanting us to learn. So the first thing is love is an energy, a force, a pull that binds us together. Life means nothing without love. Every process in the world is based on the exchange of love. If you think about it, we feed our families out of love. If we didn't love them, we could be, you know, we could not feed them. We could not clothe them or our animals we love them so we take care of them in that sense is what I mean by that we could <clears throat> excuse me we couldn't survive as a whole and as humans on earth without love if we all loved one another there would be no war there would be no violence there would be no killings there'd be no deception no mistrust and all the bad things that come when we don't have love unconditional love in our hearts why is it important for us to have self-love and love in general Why is it that we fully love someone? Do you ever ask yourself that? Why do we fall in love with this, the one person that we decide we want to spend our life with or we want to date or we want to have around? Most of the time it's simply because we're trying to escape ourselves and the person that we choose, we see the things that we like and we want as as you know, qualities in our own life that we want, maybe their personality traits that we, we admire and we really look up to. Here's an example. I've, I fell in love with this, this guy that I, I've known, a little, you know, I knew who he was. I really never hung out with him. I hung out with his friends and stuff, but I, um, I hold high regards to him and it's hard to explain to my, even myself why, I mean not why, but what it is about him that makes me so drawn to him, that makes me want to, to be around him and to have him in my life. He is, he does have all the qualities that I think I lack in life and I think that I do admire him because of that. I. I made a list of the pros and cons about him, which is funny, but I have to do that type of stuff so I stay on track. Um, and I and the things I did list about him were definitely things that I would have never listed about myself. So I do believe that to be um, true. We need to know that we're all deserving of love that no matter what anyone has told us, no matter what circumstances we have been in, no matter how people have made us feel or what they have said to us, that we all deserve love. And we deserve healthy love, not toxic, not fighting, not you know cheating on each other, not disrespecting each other, not harming each other physically, mentally, anything like that. Degree of affection from ourselves built up over the years because we deserve love 
I don't know if that makes sense. That doesn't make fucking 